Samoan, so thank you. Uh, LA is just, you know, some items strung together as a sign of affection, so I'd just like to thank my Polynesian team for this is beautiful. So, um, okay, my story, I've got two minutes to do this. Uh, um, I was lost and now I'm found, so that's pretty much it. Now, I, I spent 20 years in the Australian Army, right, so one uh, when uh, my boss, for the last few years I've been working for a really successful investor, and uh, he said to me, Lou, just watch this video. And I said, what is it? He said, it's about travel and uh, it's new in Australia, so you need to lock in a position. So I didn't lock in. I didn't actually watch the video. I actually just pulled out my credit card and bought it because I knew he was solid. Um, I did nothing with it because I joined on the 3rd of December last year. So I've been doing this part-time for six months. And um, after about three weeks, I thought I'd better look at what I've just spent my money on. And, and then I went, holy crap, I can't believe I've wasted three weeks. So once I made a decision, right, that I had to show everybody that was living and breathing this concept, I rang up eight people. Six people joined within about a week and a half. Uh, then I showed those six people how to get their six people. And then from then on, it went nuts. It went so nuts. Um, I then started doing in-home presentations, I started doing, you know, pre uh, Facebook messages, SMSs, any way I could possibly work out how to do it, I actually did it. And then I went over to United at Kansas City um, because I'd never been to a big event before, so I thought, you know, I know that being in the military, you need to be disciplined and you need to have training because if you don't have training, your soldiers are shit. So I understood that concept very clearly and I went over there and I took 40 people with me. We came back and just exploded our businesses. One of the main things I learned was Bam Fam from, um, oh, the lady with the beautiful red dress. Uh, Bethany Webster. Bam Fam, so book a meeting from a meeting. So what I did is I had a house party, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and then I had it in three different states. I then went to those states and showed those people how to conduct a, a travel party, which is just simply press play and close, right? And then I zipped up to Brisbane and did the same thing. So for the Samoans that are in the room, like that I just came back from uh, Brisbane, 87 of them joined last week, wow. right? These guys have no computers, they have no Facebook. Not many of them I had to create Gmail accounts for. So when people come to me and go, hey, dude, I've got this big business owner, I've got this amazing network marketer, what a load of crock of shit. Because honestly, anybody, honestly, anybody that has got a burning desire to, to make a change in their life will actually make this happen more so than the most wealthiest man on the planet. Does that make sense? Right, so I've got five seconds. I would just like to take the time to thank you, um, World Ventures, Thank you, um, uh, Wayne Nugent, for having an unbelievable vision. Thank you, Marcus Setta. Like, you are, man, you're up there with the best. I have to say that, honestly. So, um, you know, without the trainers, without the leadership, without the vision, and without the team, 